Hello everyone, this is Juan Diaz Garay. I'm from San Felipe, Chile, but now I'm living in Salt Lake City, Utah, and I'm starting this YouTube channel, first of all, because I love board games, and my English is not the best, so I'm trying to do things in this quarantine um, to practice my English and improve that, so I'm trying to do things that I like, like doing boxings, like board games, like all the kind of stuff in English, so I want to apologize myself for you, because my English is not going to be the best, but I want to show you some board games and like card games that I like, so I'm going to tell you about me a little bit, uh, I'm 27 years old, I was store owner in Chile, had my own store of board games and video games for around 4 years, and then when I moved to the state, I sold my store, and I'm here for like 2 years, I'm like still learning English, it's super difficult, and so today I want to start my YouTube channel because I'm trying to find ideas to do the things that I like on quarantine, so um, today I'm going to bring you two of the most like best things for me. I love WWE. I'm a big fan of WWE. I was in WrestleMania before. I really love that. And I love Dice Master, who is a board game that I'm collecting. It is one of the board games that I sell on my store in Chile. It's really, really good. It's super funny if you want to play with your family or you want to play with friends or whatever. Uh, this board game is from um, Witskit, and they like mix up all the universe, like the universe that you like, like Marvel, like DC Comics, like um, TMNT, like uh, Dungeon Dragons, like Warhammer, um, they have a bunch of stuff, you know, you can find a bunch of stuff right there, and then they start to like a partnership with WWE, and they launch this product, this item that is like super cool for me, that is like a campaign box of WWE, and then they launch this expansion for the game, you know, so if you have these three items, you have the collection complete about WWE, you know. So I want to start this YouTube channel with this unboxing because I really love this. And also, it's a WrestleMania week, you know, for this stuff, the COVID-19. WrestleMania was canceled, actually, not canceled, but was like, I don't want to talk about that. But the thing is, uh, I really love this and I want you, like, to join with me to, like, help me to improve my English and to enjoy all the unboxing that we are going to start in this channel. Yeah, probably we're going to have uh, unboxings from Dragon Ball, Super TCG. We're going to have unboxings from Magic, from Pokemon. I don't know. But it's going to be super fun. Thank you so much for watching this video. And I'm so sorry for my English. But I will try to do my best. So we are going to start with this unboxing. I'm going to start first with this box. That is the campaign box. The campaign box actually, like... The hundred percent of the time because they're campaign box because they have two boxes there are the collector box and the campaign box the campaign box brings 76 dice and brings like the Complete collection of the dice that you need in your game Okay, so this one brings like 76 different dice or like two from each dice and you can find like cards for this dice They're really this game is really good if you want to play with family with friends or just want to have a good time uh, you can play this game um, just with two persons, so you can add more people. But this one, um, it's going to be good for you if you want to play like four players. It's going to be good. So I'm going to start unboxing. I'm sorry if this is moving a lot because I'm trying to like create this place to make the unboxings. That is not like similar that we have in Chile because we have a store. And in the store, we like made videos all the time. So we have our own like place to do unboxing. So... That was very different to the thing that I'm trying to make here in my house. And my wife wants to keep me out because I have the house full of crap, you know, like full of Dice Master, WWE belts, video games, and all this stuff. So now I'm putting this practice off. Now I'm gonna give you the camera again. So this is the camping box. I'm gonna try to like put this out right now. Okay, so all the camping box or all the like collector box bring this kind of stuff. This is the manual, like the manual is going to show you like the rules of the game and everything on it. So it's like kind of cool. So if you don't never played Dice Master before, this manual is going to teach you how to play and it's going to be super useful for you. Uh, this kind of stuff brings like two mini play mats that you can like use to guide yourself to play the game. Yeah, this game is very easy, 
probably if you want, probably you have more tutorials on YouTube, but if you want, we can like make a tutorial in the future. Uh, this is the checklist of the edition. So you have all the cards and all the dices here. So if you want like to collect the edition, you have to finish this. So you have bit rivals, tag teams, there's a pension one, and this is like a promotional poster of that. So it's pretty cool. So, um, all the collector books have this kind of like stuff so you can like collect your dice here like literally <laughs> and they have some bags because you need bags to play this game you put the dices inside the bags so this one brings two bags like i think they are the same bags yeah not the difference so uh this gives you two bags so it's for two players so if you want to play with more people you have to make or have your own bags um and they have the cards right here should be like 50 cards i guess different with the actions and all the stuff who need you to play um how can i play this game uh, you can mix all the different universes that you want. You can use like two characters from DC Comics. You can use two characters from WWE. You can use a character from D&D. Uh, &D, whatever. It's up to you. So that's it's really good in this game that you can mix everything. If you are a fan of WWE, in this game you can finally clash John Cena and Roman Reigns against Superman. Yeah. Um, this is the first one. This is the phenomenal one, AJ Styles. So I have three cards from AJ Styles. So probably one of them, they're very good and the others are crap, you know? So you have four cards, but you only have two dices for AJ Styles. So you have to buy another collector box to have that. I know it's stupid, but it's how they make the game. You have three Askas, you have three Beck Lynch the Man, you have three Bobby Heenan. Wow, Bobby Heenan. You have three Brett the Hitman Heart. You have three Charlotte Flares. Three Eddie Guerrero. Wow, that's awesome. Three John Cena. Three Kurt Angle. They have a lot of legends. That's cool. You have three Macho Man Randy Savage. Three Mankind. Three Ric Flares. Three Ronda Rousey for, from USC. Three Sacha Banks. Three Chinsuke Nakamura. Three Triple H. A moment of bliss okay those are the actions you know so they are different they have different dice you can use any dice from other editions of dice master so if you have the action dice from other edition it's not a problem this actions you can have you have to pick two actions for player and with these actions you can like do extra stuff you know for your game so we have a moment of bliss jerry lauder we have booker t we have Share Smash, Share Smash, Miss TV, Money in the Bank, Paige Manier, you have Paul Heyman, great Paul Heyman, The Kevin Owens Show, you have Walk with Elias, and you have four uh, colors for the actions. Uh, be why these colors? Yeah, because you have the dice here for the actions. They're the same color that those cards. So you can like assign for the green one or for the red one or whatever, you're gonna have this kind of dice. Yeah, those dice are the different colors and they have the same faces. So you can use this dice for whatever action do you want that is not like, oh, this is black, I have to use black. No, you can use the uh, orange one and you only have to do is put the orange one right there. So that means that this is the orange one. So this is super easy. It is super friendly with the people who wants to like learn how to play the game. So we have the cards, actions, we have the characters here, and maybe, let me double check, um, we are going to be able to like put the dice here in a row. So we have like the orange ones, the red ones, and we have the basic action dice. You have to start your game with eight of this basic action dice that is, looks like this. They have six faces, they have like the fist. They have the question, the lens, the um, like thunder, you have the shield, and you have the psychic. So with this psychic, you can attack, obviously, but we never want to have psychics, you know? You want to have like energies to buy your character. So 
you have the blue one, psychic on the bottom, you have the purple, red, like orange. I'm gonna fix this, I'd like to use a video for that. So you should have four dice of each one color and the psychic dices. I think that I missed one. I missed actually like four. <laughs> oh yeah, okay, they are in the other bag. So you need eight dice. So it's four, it's eight from player. If you're playing with two people, you need 16 dice of this one. So we have two, four, five, 10, 12, 40, and 16, 16 dice. And you need four for every action. So I think that the game, or the game is screw me with dices, or they put that in the other bag with the characters. Uh, 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 uh. Look at this. So they, they screw me with dices, yeah? But it's okay, I have like a bunch of dices, so it's not a problem for me. Um, okay, so the good of this game, the thing that I like from this game, that every character have their own dice, you know? So Triple H have like the cross from Triple H. So this is the dice for Triple H. And only this dice, here, here, yeah. Only this one works with Triple H because have the symbol from Triple H. So if you see that, they have like three phases of energy and have three phases of attack or character. So Triple H in the game is going to be this dice. Okay, if you're going to use Triple H on the game, this is going to be the dice who is going to represent Triple H. So that's pretty cool. Um, I can probably recognize every dice just seeing the character. This is Mankind for sure. Um, we have like um, Kurt Angle, it's like Captain America one. We have another Mankind dice, and we have here and Sasha Bang one. So I'm not gonna bore you with all the dices that we have here. So I'm gonna start to open the other pack. Like this is gonna be um, the tag team pack. Uh, they should they screw me with dices. That sucks because you have. You need four dices for action. Um, at least that they tell you that you only can use two or three, but I don't think so. I think that action dices, they allow you to use like four each one. So, oh, use three, use three, use three, use three, use three. Okay, so this one use three dice per action. So it should be three of each one. So they give me one more of the, um, orange ones but they don't give me a red so i'm gonna put that right there and we have three of each one so that's awesome okay um so i'll have all my cards here from the from the set i'm gonna put all the dice here from the set too so i can like make a review in spanish because i have a youtube channel on spanish and you if you're a spanish speaker you can check my videos i have like a hundred videos of unboxings in spanish from different tcg and board games so if you like if you like Spanish or you are learning Spanish, that's going to help you a lot because I have like a bunch of videos, including Dice Masters, Dragon Ball, Pokemon, Magic the Gathering, and another TCGs exclusively from Chile. So you're going to be very, very good watching my videos and you're going to like try to do different stuff during the pandemic, you know? So I'm going to put everything here so I can make a review later in my own other YouTube channel. Those are the dice from the game. And... This is getting close. Okay, another like tip that I can give you that the collector box brings some booster packs here in the bottom. Yeah, this is empty because this is a um, campaign box who have all the dices that you need. So you don't have to buy booster box or booster packs because you have everything here. So I'm gonna put all the stuff here back. I missed the bag, so that sucks. But I'm gonna put all the stuff here back in the box with the play mats, like kind of play mats. And I'm gonna close the box again. And I'm gonna show you now the two expansion packs, Better Rivals and Tag Team, okay? I'm gonna start with Better Rivals because I know that Shawn Michaels, my favorite wrestler, is here. Yeah, so I'm gonna try to open this very carefully to don't break that that much. <laughs> I'm gonna break it anyway, but I don't want to destroy this that much. 
I'm so excited for this game because I was waiting for this. They supposed to launch this game uh, during August last year, but they like canceled the launch and they relaunched the game during Christmas and then they canceled Christmas stuff and they relaunched the game like two months ago, something like that. So, these are the cards. I missed one of the dice, so I'm gonna pick that up later because I cannot find them. So, okay, so we have here Bitter Rivals, okay. We have Brett, the Hitman Heart, another legend. I'm not pretty sure if this one was in the pack, but I have three cards of Brett, and probably I have only two dice from Brett, yeah? The dice from Brett are like the glasses from Brett Heart, so that's pretty cool. You have two. You have three Kings cards, and... I think those are the dices. No, there's a black ones. Okay, with the mask. So these are the cane dices. No, the camera is gonna focus anytime. It's right there. Oh, okay. This is the cane dices with the mask. We have Lita. Yeah, she's one of the superstar from the Attitude Era. Very famous. And the Lita's one are this ones. Okay. Oh, it's three Stratus. Okay, I missed one of the latest one in the floor, so I'm gonna pick that up later. This is the Lita one. I have two from each character. HBK Shawn Michaels. Okay, this is kind of sad because the the amount to buy this is four energies, and that sucks because it's empty. So you have to pay five to play with the HBK. I don't know if it's really good. But uh, if one of the Chon Michael Superstar die is the only Superstar die in your field, it get three attack and three defense. Wow, really good. If one Chon Michael Superstar die is the only Superstar in your field zone, at the end of your turn, print two dice. Wow, it's really good, Chon Michaels. It's very, very good. Uh, but I think this one should be like three or two to make the game like more friendly with the card without effect. So we have the two HBK dices. Is a heartbreak pretty cool we have Stone Cold Steve Austin this is one of the greatest super in the attitude era too uh, I'm gonna put this here a little bit I have the two Stone Cold Steve Austin dice you have like the broken school this is the symbol of Stone Cold Steve Austin I don't know if the camera can make like the focus perfect so that's the Stone Cold one we have that perfect and we are gonna have The Rock, Dwayne Johnson, very famous now for the movies. The two from Dwayne Johnson, they're like the Brahma Bull. It's right there. The fuck is not very good, but okay. Um, we have here too, three Stratus, the sexy bomb from the 90s. It's right here too, I'm gonna put that. Over Lita and three cards from the Phenom the Undertaker yeah and this are the two dices from the Undertaker um, bitter rivals in this edition there's like the Undertaker against Kane brothers of destruction they were rivals in the attitude era so probably that's the reason why they're in bitter rivals uh, we have Brett the Hidden Heart and Shawn Michaels like one of the greatest rivalry in the history of WWE. We have Lita and Trish Stratus, best friends, bitter rivals, and we have The Rock and Stone Cold Steve Austin, like two of the greatest stars from the Attitude Era. So probably that's the reason why they're like bitter rivals because they have a bunch of rivalries on those eras, okay? So I'm gonna put this away, and I'm gonna put all the cards together so I can like make the explanation in the Spanish later perfect and now we're gonna open the tag team one so this one uh, this one is the one who brings Roman Reigns for all the people who is asking what is Roman Reigns it's this box who brings Roman Reigns so if you are a Roman Reigns or Seth Rollins fan this is your box okay this is very small but this is pretty cool actually because have the new day too there is another faction very famous in WWE. So we have Big E Lanston. We have three cards from Big E. We have Kevin Nash from the NWO. I'm gonna show you the dice from Big E. I guess they are these ones. Yeah. This one is from 
Xavier Good. So probably it's Xavier Good and not Coffee Kingston. We have two here. Uh, the NWO Dices. There's this one. Wow, there's two energies. That's pretty cool. You have two energies in some cards, so that's pretty cool. Oh, all of them brings three energies, two energies. So you have Coffee Kingston. There's not Savior Goods. It's Coffee Kingston. There's right here with uh, Biggie Lanston. Actually, those are from Biggie, uh, Biggie Lanston, the E1. Wow, so they bring the three New Day characters. That's a waste of like game. We have three Roman Reigns. Uh, the affiliation is the shield. So every card, oh no, not like every card, but the most of the cards have like affiliation. That means they're like they're uh, Justice League, or they are like Avengers, or they are NWO like this ones, or they are like New Day like this one. So they potential each other, you know, see if they have some bonuses. They're gonna say uh, only like um, Shield ones can attack and only Shields, Shields one can like receive bonus, whatever. So that's pretty good because you can make like your own Avengers deck and all the characters that you have there are Avengers, so they like give bonuses between them. So that's pretty cool. I have a Scott Hall here. This is from NWO, right there. So Scott Hall, oh, this is a Sting. I think it's this one, yeah. It's the same one, Razor Ramon. This is here, Scott Hall. We have two dices. Roman Reigns should be this one, with the symbol of Roman Reigns. You have Seth freaking Rollins. This is Seth Rollins with the shield affiliation. So you have two dices from Seth Rollins. So that's one of the things who the people hate about Dice Master. Uh, they make you like buy stuff, but they like screw you and they make you buy double. If you want to have four dice of each character, that the lot of dice the cards allow you to have four dices, you have to buy two packages of each one. So that's make the people sick and they don't want to buy Dice Master anymore. Um, I think they're screwing people, and that's sad, but it's part of the business, you know? So this one is Xavier Wood, so we have the three New Day characters with the three dices, and we have the NWO, that should be Scott Hall, um, Sting, and Kevin Nash. This is not the normal NWO, this is the Wolfpack NWO symbol, because it's red, and this one is black and white. And you have bot members from the Shield, because all the people who, like, still in touch with WWE or Wrestling World, they know that Dean Ambrose isn't already wrestling. So this is a very complete pack. I'm like pretty, I don't know. I would like to have a complete edition of WWE, you know, to open booster packs and then all the stuff. But I feel like good because I have all the cards right now. So I don't have to buy more stuff, that cool. But I sh think that sh they should put more superstar, you know, like more characters. They're really good, like... Uh, I don't know, like, maybe more Attitude Era guys like Edge, Christian, or another tag team like the Dudley Boys and the Hardy Boys, and probably they have to put more characters, like right now they have Bobby Lashley, Goldberg, they have um, Drew McIntyre, and a bunch of new superstars that they are not inside the game. I hope they're going to launch after, with the time, more characters for this game, but I'm pretty, like, feel good with this because i'm gonna have more dice from my collection and i'm gonna start to use this pack that i was saving this like to the moment that i'm gonna start my youtube channel so thank you so much guys for following this video i'm so sorry for my english i'm trying to improve this i'm trying to create this space like with the micro and with a stand for the camera to make this and like have fun with people who loves wwe board games uh card games and all this stuff because i'm gonna use everything uh, in my unboxing so next unboxing it's gonna be of dice master one two i have a x-men box so i'm gonna open that x-men box for my next unboxing and probably the next unboxing after that it's gonna be about dragon ball super card game so thank you so much for following my youtube channel if you like this content you can subscribe uh you can give us like a like or um, like mark the bell and everything Thank you so much for following us. Um, we're gonna improve this for sure. We're gonna work to like give you better access, better cameras and all the stuff. But we are starting this, we're so excited and we are taking like everything 
that we can do to enjoy this pandemic stuff in our house. So we hope that you can stay in your house, you can be safe, and you can like um, survive all, all of this, you know, like have a good life and enjoy every second that you have. So thank you so much, guys. Follow our YouTube channel. And if you are a Spanish speaker, uh, you can follow our YouTube channel. It's WWE in Espanol and the Multiverse Unboxing. The same this, the Multiverse Unboxing. Probably if you put the Multiverse Unboxing, YouTube is going to show you the bot channels. Um, but in the Spanish one, you're going to see a lot of WWE content. But behind the WWE content, you're going to find like a hundred videos from different unboxing different eras of the tcg like pokemon Yu Gi Oh, magic the gathering dice master uh meet the in the a chilean like tcg and you're gonna find like super good videos made with a lot of love from guys who love the board games thank you so much guys have a wonderful day enjoy and be safe see you soon